micro credentials allow us to tell really strong stories that are rooted in evidence where if you think about education as like living in these silos we're like tapping into and breaking that like silo down so we can really see like what's happening in that classroom that should be celebrated. I would say this one is much more hands-on. This is focused on producing a product instead of just passively listening in on a, some kind of seminar. We always hear that term job embedded, professional development, but this was truly job embedded in that uh, the work is truly relevant. Getting told what to do is really difficult, and so having a choice in what you're doing and how you're able to get there is, I think, really important to being an adult learner because it's honoring who you are as an adult learner. I think the biggest challenge really was just breaking down the directions into manageable pieces. I'm the kind of person that just puts everything out on the floor, tries to put it together, make mistakes, whatever. I am not the kind of person that diligently reads these instructions, and so that was very overwhelming for me. The time management, I think, was the most difficult piece. When you're doing it during a very busy school year, it is so much different from just registering for a fall course that meets seven to nine on Wednesdays. It's all your time, it's on your, you know, uh, it's all about your calendar, and it's about getting to it when you, when you can get to it. I brought up the term grain size to one of the teachers the other day, and she said this is more like a loaf. They were, you know, very frustrated with the process, but I think that's what the pilot is all about. The old evaluation system where it took you 10 hours to write a uh, plan. I really don't care if I'm going to get a badge out of it, but I'm hoping that the work that I can do it will lead me to the right resources and give me the feedback that I need to be a better person. I'm a big believer in teacher-driven, teacher-selected professional development. I'm not really a top-down person, so I liked the idea that I could make a choice. I also believe in collaboration, which is a big concept, I guess, with the micro-credentialing. As a district, it would be great to use this as an opportunity to have choice with our professional development. Uh, things that we think are important for us, whether it be a personal goal, a professional goal, a department goal, or a district goal, can all be met by the micro-credentialing um, opportunities.